Right now I'm testing out this new design for my thank you cards because I'm pretty tired of printing so many of these scratch off cards when I can just kill two birds with one stone and put it on my thank you card. So I'm testing this design out. I'm going to add a code right here for the returning customers. I also made some changes to the connect with us to make it like a little bit more engaging so um, it can get customers to follow me on the other platforms um, and check out, you know, all the different um, social medias I have. I don't know if this is too much though. I don't know. What do you guys think? Like, is it too much? I think it's okay, but it, it's like, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. But anyways, let's print this out and see how it comes out. You guys. It came out so stinking cute. Look at this. It I, I measured that perfectly, if I do say so myself, like in between those little accents. Oh my god, it is absolutely gorgeous. I am obsessed. I am going to tweak it a little bit though because um, the circle underneath is a little bit too small. The circle underneath this. I actually think this looks way better than it does um, on the computer, but in paper, the um, little like cell phone thing looks... Oh, I'm just obsessed. It's gorgeous. It is absolutely gorgeous. Obsessed. And and just for reference, this is the old one. Definitely is such a huge improvement. I would love this one way better. Just looks more professional. This one is way more engaging and it actually makes me want to look at like what's on here and reduces waste because I'm not going to be having to print all those individual scratch off cards. I just got this like a uh, little studio box from Amazon. And um, I got this because I wanted to start taking like more professional pictures of my products and things like that. So I'm kind of setting it up so that I don't see the reflection of, whoops. I'm trying to figure out how I can set it up so that I don't see the reflection of the lights that are right here. Um, beautiful lighting, by the way. It's absolutely beautiful. But like, you see what I'm saying? Like if I want to take a picture like this. Okay, right there, it kind of hides it because of the, of the design. It's like behind the boots. But if you turn it, see you can kind of see so at certain angles it works and this is how a scrunchie looks so i'll zoom in so you can see how the pictures would come out so it would look something like that and it looks so nice this lighting is gorgeous this is from amazon if you guys are interested in it it comes with a white backdrop a black backdrop this is the little cover for the top right here and i've got a bunch of these thingies which are again more backgrounds so there's that it was about 36 dollars, and this is the 12 by 12 size if you're going to be needing something that's big enough for bottles like this i would definitely recommend the 12 by 12 size if you have smaller products like scrunchies or anything like around this size you don't have to get the 12 by 12 it might be too big so as you can see like i don't need this giant thing just for the scrunchie but i got this for my cup i'm at 99 orders so i just have to make one cup this is the bunny milk carton water bottle also some new organization going on here i got this little thing at marshall's and i love it it's supposed to be a craft and picture storage but i'm using it for pre-cuts of um already made designs so we gotta go to this one here and pull out the bunnies so you just pull out the ones that you need and you just close it up put it back and there you go it's just perfect to have pre-cuts already made so that when you have like when you get an order for like this type of design you just pull it out and you just put them on there and they're ready to go the cutting and layering is what takes the longest time the application is pretty quick but that is what takes forever so also i also got some bigger ones for like my vinyl scraps, HTV scraps, and HTV, and then my just big sheets of permanent vinyl. These are 12 by 12. They're on sale for $5 right now at Michael's. I don't know if they're still going to be on sale by the time you guys see this video, but if they are and you have like, if and if you need storage, check those out. So I'm going to get ready to make this cup. Let's move you guys a little bit up. This thing is driving me freaking crazy, guys. Like just, I'm sorry, ignore it, but it is driving me crazy. Okay, I need to get my base. I am all over the place today. But I am making a water bottle right now. It's wet because I washed it and I forgot to like leave it over to dry. But anyways, I use, I have one of each of my designs just for like water or like uh, as a guide. What am I looking for? I am looking for transfer tape. I am, what is going on today? Okay, I am all over the place today, guys. All right, so. 
It's just one of those days. Okay, side note, I got this vinyl. This is the worst vinyl I've ever used. Um, I got it off Amazon, so if you come across this, it's um, by Vivid. It is absolutely horrendous. I always get like air bubbles in like this. Like this. Like it just does, it creases so badly. Like that. That shouldn't be happening, guys. Let's get to making this bottle. I'm going to go ahead and finish this cup and then we will pack it together. You guys, I did it. This is insanity. I did it. Like 100 orders, guys. 100 orders in five months. Like this is so much better than I could have imagined. Like I really did not expect to get this far it really may not be a lot to some people but to me this is a huge milestone for me i'm so proud of myself this is all because of you because of you guys like my supporters the guy the people that watch me just because you don't buy from me doesn't mean that you're not contributing with you engaging with my content i am able to reach customers and get my you know content out there thank you thank you thank you thank you a million times thank you I'm filming a video for tiktok and I'm packing an abandoned cart order because I got to 100 orders. And just as a little thank you, I wanted to give back to someone. And I'm also going to be putting in a promo code. Sorry, let me make sure it's in the frame. I'm also going to be putting some promo codes in that video for like 20% off, I'm thinking. Just to like, you know, give back to my community and say thank you. So just something nice to do. Um, for someone even though maybe you never know they maybe couldn't afford it at the time or whatever How do you guys feel about this angle? I feel like it's you can't even really see anything, huh? I don't know this angle is kind of bad Let me know if that's a little bit better I'm trying out a different angle today, and I don't know if I like it. So I don't know. We'll see Also, guys, check it out. Check it out. Look at my new Polly Mueller's. I got this one and I also got, um, there it is. I also got scrunchies. So stinking cute, you guys. I'm obsessed. These are samples from Sticker Mule. They're 10 samples for like uh, $9 or something like that. You can get like three different samples for like $27, something like that. Add like some sticker packs for a dollar or even get like another sample for make it close to $40. Use the $10 credit in the description and you'll get $10 off your entire order, which is such a good deal. Definitely take advantage of that um, $10 credit in my description. Again, you can use this on poly mailers. You can use it on anything in the store, but I'm just talking about specifically poly mailers. I also get my custom tape from them as well if you want to try it on that, but yeah, definitely check them out. There we go. I just packed an abandoned car. My first one. I'm so excited to be doing these. I definitely want to do more in the future. I just got this box from Amazon and it's basically just a bunch of crinkle paper. This is a 10 pound box and it was about $50. This is like too much to store. I don't really think you can see how big it is, but it's pretty big. I've been looking on Amazon for paper cutters, but I can't find any that cut, you know, like crinkle and stuff. So I need to do, keep doing research, but I think eventually I will get my own cutter for this. I'm gonna pack two orders and we're gonna try this out. Okay, you guys might be a little lower than usual, but that's because I broke my tripod right now. Let's fill the bottom. I'm also testing out these new like little stickers to put on my boxes. Um, I used to have something different. It was getting a little bit old, so we're trying out something new today. And basically it just says like if you tag us on social media, we'll send you a code for 15% off future orders. I don't know where it cut off, but she got a milk carton water bottle, some mini hair clips, and also a navy clip and some other things. And I wanted to say that these were actually selling pretty well. This color in particular has been doing pretty good. I think I'm out of stock or I might have one more. I'm not sure, but yeah, that's kind of surprising. I'm out of stock of these. I have to restock that. So she got that. She also got two scrunchies. I 
I just got these new poly mailers. Well, they're not a new design or anything. They're just a new size. So I wanted to try it out. This box definitely can go in a smaller bag, but that's okay. I want to try these out. So... This is the 14 by 19 size, and this is from Sticker Mule. So if you guys want a $10 credit, if you want to try it out, there will be a link in the description of this video. I love Sticker Mule, you guys. Like, seriously, they're the best. They are the best. I love them so much. And... Boom. Okay, so earlier in this video, you saw that I upgraded my thank you cards. Fast forward to now, I've made some more changes. Everything on the front is the same, but I've made it double-sided, guys. We're reducing even less waste now because, as you guys know, I had, like, individual cards for my freebie stickers. Not anymore. Obsessed. I can't. Look how cute it is. Still talking about the thank you cards. I just love that I'd multitask because I have a lot to do right now. I am going to be outsourcing my thank you cards now because um, even though I can print them at home, doesn't mean I should, if that makes sense. Like, at this point, it makes more sense to outsource than to print them at home because, one, they're double-sided now, which takes forever, like, especially on my printer, my little printer he's a fighter and everything but he takes forever like he's extremely slow it probably takes like literally one minute to print one page of photo paper high quality image on this printer and imagine that double-sided like it's it's an it's going to be a nightmare so i am going to be outsourcing and it's time either way because i i keep finding myself running out of supplies when i'm um, packing orders my brand is pretty stable now so I don't think I'll be making too many changes to my packaging anytime soon so I think it might be okay it's even cheaper for me to outsource because if you order in bulk um, it, it comes out cheaper than how how much it costs me to print them so yeah I definitely think it's time I'm kind of excited because it is a lot of work to print and cut all of the uh, thank you cards and all the like individual things that I do like my cup care cards and things like that it's a lot of work when you're first starting off I definitely recommend doing that instead of ordering that's what's happening with that and of course when I get them I'll uh, let you guys know all the details of where I got them how much they were okay guys so I'm gonna finish this up get to editing and I will see you guys in the next one